Well, I've always liked the city. Like, from a very young age, I used to come here, like, on family visits and things. Um, and it was kind of my aspiration to study here. Eventually, through, like, a love of history and sciences, I found that archaeology was, like, a perfect course that combined the two for me. York is amazing for archaeology. I mean, we were in such a lovely setting for it. It's a really good department and combines like quite a different amount of teaching styles. So you get quite small seminar groups um, where you can interact really closely with your tutor and then uh, the big classic lectures um, and you get examined in different ways as well. So you have the classic exams and then practical exams that test your kind of excavation technique and um, technique in examining finds, for example. And it's that combination and the variety as well, which is really unique for York. In the archaeology department, you're taught by like the pioneers in the field. So they talk a lot about their own research. And then you go and read the paper and you're like, oh, I had a lecture by them. Um, and that really inspires you because you're working with people who have brought their subjects further along in archaeology. We have unique excavations like at Starkar, which got a European research grant. Academically standing, like it's amazing for a department in the UK. Um, and that's what attracted me to York. It starts you um, thinking more independently and um, finding papers, for example, and academic journals that really touch on the subjects that you're interested in. And that helps you develop your own interest in the subject, rather it being directed for you. It allows you to kind of enjoy the subject more, in my opinion, um, because I, I now just read papers out of, like, for the fun of it, rather than it being directly um, related to the course. Locationally, there are like quite a few opportunities, particularly as an archaeology student, um, to go into different careers. For example, all of the museums facilitate those who want to go into the heritage and conservation sector. In archaeology, um, you can get volunteering placements, like I'm doing a voluntary placement over summer with Jorvik Dig. And the Jorvik Network, um, they have loads of volunteering opportunities, particularly for students. And we get um, a lot of emails that go around saying we need volunteers kind of thing. So there's always a lot of things to do that will boost your employability and a lot of volunteering opportunities and even uh, placement opportunities within York. I say to someone who wants to come to York that it's a really friendly community and there's so much that York has to offer. It has great scenery, a great location within the city, great opportunities and it really helps you to pursue the career that you want to and will do everything to make sure that you are happy with your studies here.